Hey guys, we're taking Jackson to his first vet appointment with us. He's got his head out the window. He's enjoying the breeze. Jackson, you ready for the vet? No. Mario got out of the car and little man started crying, literally like crying, crying. It's okay, baby. It's okay. I switched masks because I was buying them at 95 and being everyone has a mask on, and I can wear this. <laughs> Jax, it's okay, baby. You look so cute with your new collar. Yeah. We got him a new collar that has his name embroidered and our phone number. In case, God forbid, he gets lost. But this little guy is so attached, I uh, pray that he doesn't get lost and stays with us. Right, Jackson? Yeah, you're a good boy. So Jackson is out of the vet. Unfortunately, we couldn't go in. I felt really bad. But with COVID, um, it's the best thing for everybody. So Jackson went in and he uh, did well. I think uh, they even cut his nails a bit because they were sharp. And yeah, I'm glad he did okay. So uh, he's on a little walk now at Rosario. So that way he doesn't pee pee in the car. And um yeah, and I won't be headed home. We're just waiting for them to get us his heartworm pills and uh, and pay them and stuff like that. So that's really it. Um, I think we're just going to relax today. Maybe go in the pool. We'll see. And um, was a good really boy it. at the vet. He's going to get his puppuccino. Yum. Is that so good? <laughs> he loves it. You're a good boy. All right, right. Yeah, you're, you're a good closer. boy at the vet. Closer. Lunch time for us. Late lunch. We got nice grilled hot dogs that are a bit charred, but they taste mm -hmm. delicious, right? I think maybe because they were skinless. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Really good. Guys, it's the final walk of the night. I got an ice cream bar. It's the final countdown. No manners, he doesn't even ask. I give him one bite before, and now he takes the whole thing. I need the fat, man. You gave me permission when you said yes. And I do. I guess so. <laughs> I guess that's how it works. So anyway, I'm going to finish enjoying this. This is my fat for the night, 12 grams for my trichafta, so that's a nice amount. 12 grams, wow. I know, in one barn, it's delicious. Great. So, you're going to finish walking. We'll say goodnight to you guys because we're going to go to sleep. We have an appointment in the morning. I don't think morning. Two appointments. The afternoon. Early afternoon. One o'clock. We have blood work, which will help us um, figure out whether or not I need dialysis or not. And <clears throat> I mean, I don't think I do, but obviously the numbers <clears throat> tell the best. And we have to do a consult, right? And I feel like I've also gotten used to just feeling tired and not great. So the numbers will be good to see. And... I got an eye appointment tomorrow, so usually I see her every like six, six weeks, um, but it's been many months due to COVID, so we'll have that checked out too, and uh, we'll say goodnight. Thank you for watching. See you guys tomorrow on the road. I said goodnight, but they're just the cutest, the two of them, the way they walk. Jackson thought he saw something under one of the cars, so <laughs> yeah. You know what I'm talking about you? So you got very cautious the way he walked. Yeah, baby. Stance. Say goodnight, guys. I'm gonna Good hunt night. the ground Good over here. Good morning, I told you you'd see us on the road. We're headed to the doctor. I think I told you guys last night, but I have blood work first, and then I gotta get my eyes checked. And, uh, so yeah, from what I understand, I was told not to bring any guests, visitors, whatever you want to say, so I'll be going on myself, and so I'll be in the car. Guys, they took my temperature, and now I'm just gonna go actually get the blood work. Alright guys, the blood work was done in about 10 minutes total, not bad. So it's 1 o'clock now, my next appointment's 1.45, I've never been this early for appointments before. Pretty good. Hi guys, I'm in my appointment now. I did the um, exam, eye exam, where I read the letters to check my vision, and then um, I'm waiting for them to dilate me, and then they could actually look and see what's going on with the vessels and everything. Um, so that's really it. Guys, we're 
in the car heading home. All went well. Cannot believe my appointment was under an hour, which is amazing. Yeah, good news. Yeah, my eyes are actually better than the last time, showing less fluid, or rather whatever you want to say, protein in the eye. So that is great. Um, my left eye looks amazing. My right eye is the one with the fluid, but it's less than last time. So the main thing is to keep my blood pressures in control and my sugars, and um, it'll help keep my eyesight. So <coughs> That's where we're at. And uh, we were also talking that the doctor said after transplant, um, you know, the steroids, I have to watch out because that could affect my eyes as well. So we'll see what happens. And uh, God willing, we can keep things in control. But for now, we're driving home happy and um, yeah. looking forward to eating something yeah. for lunch. And I also, don't know what yet, but we'll see. I wanted to just say thank you to anybody that has found our channel now through uh, TCA Gaming. We appreciate the support and uh, yeah, stay tuned. Yeah, thank you guys so, so much. You guys uh, truly have hearts of gold. We can't thank you enough. Um, we pr appreciate all your support and the love that you guys are showing us. So thank you and thank you to everybody who's donated to the GoFundMe page. We couldn't have done it without you guys so thank you so so much it's lessening the burden on us of what we already are dealing with medical let alone the expenses that comes with it so thank you guys so much from the bottom of our hearts and from the bottom of my lungs <laughs> so um we'll keep you guys posted and thank you for joining us guys jackson attacked me when i came in now he's happy to see his daddy you happy to see your daddy do you want to see your daddy yeah your little tail's going oh you want your daddy Jackson is taking the sun. He loves sitting in the sun. You being a good boy. Jackson, go on your blanket. On your towel. Jackson. On your towel. Hey guys, it's beautiful out here. Me, Jackson, Rosario went in the pool and I'm taking the sun and now me and Jackson are drying and uh, my mother and Rosario are in the pool. Getting some sun out here and uh, just relaxing. We're just drying off a bit, right Jax? Hey guys, it's therapy time. Just doing the health medication with my vest. I didn't have time to do my therapy earlier, so I'm doing it now. Beauty about being on only one chest PT per day, meaning one best therapy. Amazing. I think it's safe to say Jackson is knocked out from all his fun in the sun today. The chef here, she's got a bunch of things going. She has little creamer potatoes. She's got some butter going. We're gonna saute some garlic. And then in here, a little toaster oven we have some flounder fillets with some lemon and breadcrumbs and butter and garlic and capers oh yeah that's a mouthful say that twice i Kishi. always make it like that but never with the capers yeah the capers first time so, this time so we'll see let's how it hope comes it comes out. out good i don't even know if we need this much butter to make yeah, garlic mash but we'll have extra and we'll just take what we need from it exactly i'll tell you mm, one thing I'm it'll be the creamiest uh, mashed potatoes we've probably ever had <laughs> Are you straining the potatoes oh, yeah, as if they're in a pan? They're doing their happy dance, happy, happy dance. dance. <laughs> like That's David from uh... David from QVC. Happy dance, happy, happy dance. Happy dance, happy dance. All right, apron on because I'm always staining everything, and I figured there's a lot of butter splattering right now, so better to be safe than sorry. Please check that out. I kind of massacred getting the fish out of the pan, but other than that. Yummy. Guys, I just felt the need to vlog this real quick. So, this food is absolutely delicious. I don't know if you can tell, but I'm almost done. I'm enjoying it. The capers were a really good touch. If you guys ever make uh, like a shrimp oregano or a flounder oregano type of thing with the breadcrumb, and I suggest trying the capers. It adds like a nice kick to shrimp, it. But... Yeah, I don't know about shrimp, but. I'm only figuring because the flavor was pretty good for the fish. 
might be the same for the flan uh, for the uh, shrimp. But anyways, mm -hmm. I approve. How about you? Delicious. So I made the fish and heated up the asparagus and Rosario made the mashed potatoes and everything oh, is delicious. Kind of. I kind of assembled the mashed potatoes. She yeah, you made you know, them. Yeah, you I mashed guess. them up. That's true. I made the mashed potatoes.